all right so 11th class uh, we are to discuss two three more programs for list then i'll be discussing the output questions right now in this program the concept is that uh, you have elements you are to shift the first element to the last and other elements will be shifted to the left if i give example to you imagine a row in your class line 1 hai first line hai the child who is sitting on the first bench i sent the child to the last bench and the child which was sitting on the second bench comes in the first how many of you have understood what i want to say jo bachcha sabse aage baitha hai wo piche chala gaya aur agle bacche ek ek seat aage aate gaye the child which was already sitting on the last now he will come on the second last and the last seat becomes vacant when the last seat becomes vacant the first child goes to the last okay got it so this is the list and i have printed i have print the original list i have display the original list okay i found the length of the list and length i put in the variable x length i put in the variable x then what i did i assign the first element to the temporary variable jaise i make the working notes over here uh 20 30 40 50 60 and this is 70 okay this is 0 this is 1 this is 2 this is 3 this is 4 and this is 5 right what i have done the element which is lying at the zero index i transfer this element to temporary variable so temporary mein kya chala gaya 20 ye empty ho gaya right now i start the for loop from here i start my for loop from here and it will go till the last okay see here i have started by for loop from 1 and it will go till the end of the list l of i i is here this is i i is here okay l of i l of 1 l of 1 i place to l of 1 minus 1 ye dekho i ki value 1 hai i minus 1 equal to l of i l of 1 minus 1 equal to l of 1 to ye ban gaya l of 0 equal to l of 1 to l of 1 pe kya pada tha 30 30 ab kahan chala gaya l of 0 pe to l of 0 pe kya aa gaya 30 थर्टी यहां चला गया ओके 
ये ऐसे हो गया राइट गॉट एट देन मूविंग फर्दर आई हो गया टू आई इज टू नाउ वेट आई इज टू टू माइनस वन ओहो टू इट इज एल ऑफ टू एल ऑफ वन आई इज टू एल ऑफ टू पे जो पड़ा है वो एल ऑफ टू माइनस वन पे आ गया टू माइनस वन इज वन वॉट इज दैट एल ऑफ टू फोर्टी दैट हैज कम टू एल ऑफ टू माइनस वन टू माइनस वन इज वन सो एट वन वी हैव फोर्टी फोर्टी इधर आ गया अब ये ऐसे है दैट आई बिकम्स थ्री L of थ्री L of थ्री minus वन पे चला गया L of थ्री L of थ्री minus वन पे चला गया What is at L of थ्री फिफ्टी फिफ्टी has gone to L of टू टू means थ्री minus वन फिफ्टी यहां आ गया अब थर्ड एम हो गया देन I becomes फोर L of फोर is passed to L of फोर minus वन L of फोर passes to फोर minus वन that is थ्री और सिक्सटी आ गया उस पर सो एल ऑफ थ्री हैज सिक्सटी सिक्सटी कम्स हेयर लाइक वाइज सेवेंटी विल कम हेयर Now this position goes vacant. ये जगह खाली हो गई right? Loop get terminate. Then after the loop, the temporary variable which was created earlier, this temp twenty, it is stored to L of x minus one. Twenty इधर आ गया. How many of you have understood this? Yes, please raise your And clear how the coding is working. All right. Check it out. Check the output, all of you. I hope it is clear to everyone. All right. Then uh, proceeding to the next question. Uh, then all odd numbers. All right. Now this is another program. What you are to do here? You have a list of numbers here. You have a list of numbers. Okay. You have to arrange the numbers in such a way that first of all you have all the even numbers. then you have all the odd numbers you have to arrange the list in such a way that first of all you have all the even numbers pehle sare even number aa jaye uske piche odd numbers aaye right so this is the original list i have printed in front of you Take two list, even list, odd list. E empty list, O is the empty list. Take two list to store all the even numbers. Take the E list. 
to store all the odd numbers take the o list you can take any name you want run the for loop okay check out if element is even check out if element is even append that element to the list e agar aapka element even hai to usko e list mein dal do got it agar aapka element odd hai to usko o list mein dal do if your element is even put in the e list if your element is odd put in the o list two separate list will be ready in e list you will be having all the even numbers in o list you will be having all the odd numbers then when the loop is finished come out of the loop take the e list the even number list apply the extend function and apply and apply o list as parameter so that the elements of o list are extended at the end of e list check it out compare the original list with the new list hurry up please check it out fast yes please any doubt any queries okay if i don't want to use this method how i can extend my list how can i display my list in the similar way but i don't want to use the extend method without using the extend method what is another way to make your list yes ridhi unmute yourself sir we can do concatenation you can do concatenation okay you can do this thing l is e plus o l is equal to e plus o okay got it so again i'm writing the command here right okay so i open another program uh okay this program without using the reverse function you are to display the list in reverse order without taking the reverse function you are to display the list in the reverse order so this is your list which i have displayed in front of you print the list print the list clear and check the length of the list check the length of the list what i have done i have placed i here in the beginning j in the end i make the working notes over here 
12, 13, 14, so on till 20. I is here. J is here. Okay. J is X minus 1. How many of you understood this command? J equal to X minus 1. Is ka matlab kya? J equal to X minus 1. What it means? Yes, Devanshi. Unmute yourself, Dimanshi. Dimanshi, khud ko unmute karo. Chapanjot, you unmute yourself. Chapanjot, unmute yourself. So J is equals to X minus one matlab X length of L uh, 20 hogi to 20 uh, 10 hogi to 10 minus one uh, J ho gaya 9 and uh, last index of uh, list L is 9 to fir last pe hai. Yes. X minus one is the last element always in the list. Okay. Find out the middle element. Apni list ka middle element find kar lo. अगर आपकी लिस्ट का साइज 10 है 10 को 2 से डिवाइड करो तो आपका मिडिल इंडेक्स होगा 5 ओके क्लियर तो 50 16 0 1 2 3 4 5 ये आपका मिड है ये आपका मिड है ओके तो ये आपका पहला हिस्सा है ये आपका सेकंड हिस्सा है आई शुड बी लेस देन द मिडल आई शुड गो टिल हियर जे शुड बी मोर देन मिड जे शुड स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हियर आई इज लेस देन मिड जे इज मोर देन मिड क्योंकि आई ने आगे आगे चलना है J ne piche piche aana hai. J has to do the backward movement. I has to do the forward movement. Okay? To kya karna hai? Jo L of I pe padha hai. Usko temporary variable me daal do. Ye chala gaya temp ke andar. To temp me aage aapka 11. L of J, this L of J is 20. Isko leo L of I pe. I has 0. 20 yaha pe leo. Or L of J pe temp le jau. Ye jo temp 11 hai, isko yaha kar do. Pehle swap ho gai. Pehla element yaha se, last element yaha se, aapas mein swap ho gai. Then go to the second element. Ab I idhar a gaya. और M आ गया इधर ठीक है और J भी आ गया पीछे क्लियर अब L of two को temp पे डालो और J पे था आपका nineteen J पे था nineteen ठीक है nineteen को आप इधर ले जाओ ठीक है ये खाली हुआ जो ये empty हुआ है twelve को यहाँ ले जाओ इस वाले temp को यहाँ ले जाओ I hope the logic is clear to all what I want to do yes please is the concept clear to reverse finally J को decrement किया है I को increment किया है anybody can tell me why why J has been decrement, I has been increment. Who will tell? Yes, Ridhi. 
सर हमने जे को इसलिए डिक्रीमेंट किया ताकि वो वापस मतलब मिड की तरफ जा सके ताकि हम रिवर्स ऑर्डर कर सके और आई आगे आगे बढ़ता रहेगा तो फिर वो आगे इंक्रीज होता रहेगा ताकि जे को आगे आने की जगह मिल सके ताकि रिवर्स ऑर्डर हमारा हो सके जे तो कभी मिड को क्रॉस करेगा ही नहीं मिडल एलिमेंट तो अपने आप में ही पोजीशन पे है आई विल मूव बिकॉज आई विल मूव टिल मिड सो आई इज इंक्रीमेंटिंग जे हैज टू कम बैक टिल मिड सो जे इज डिक्रीमेंटिंग ओके सो लेट अस रन दिस कोट चेक इट आउट चेक द आउटपुट ओके एंड सॉरी हैव यू डन दिस प्रोग्राम अर्लियर इन द प्रैक्टिकल फाइल दिवानशी प्लीज टेल मी हैव यू डन दिस प्रोग्राम अर्लियर इन द प्रैक्टिकल फाइल Yes or no? If it is no, raise your hand. If it is yes, raise your thumb. All right. So please transfer this program in the practical file. This will be your tenth program. Write a program to show reverse of the list without using the inbuilt function. Yes, Samriti. What do you want to ask? सर जब हमने आउटपुट में रिवर्स लिस्ट देखी तो फिफ्टीन और सिक्सटीन की जो पोजीशन है वो थोड़ी अजीब सी नहीं थी मतलब रिवर्स लिस्ट में तो फिफ्टीन और सिक्सटीन की पोजीशन जो है वो पर फिफ्टीन मिड में ही रहा वेट सेवनटीन के बाद यहाँ पर लेस देन इक्वल टू मिड कर लो लेस देन इक्वल टू मिड कर लो हो जाएगा सेट Uh, write a please note down the question. Write a program to show reverse of the list without using the inbuilt function. Without using the inbuilt function. Okay, got it. Okay, now I show you another question. uh yeah this output question i want to discuss please go through this output question i am giving you one minute all of you try to solve in your notebooks open your rough notebook and try to solve this output question hurry up please be fast and then raise your hand to discuss the answer yes please a list is there in front of you and uh, i have run the for loop up till the middle i have run the for loop up till the middle so if the size of list is 2 to 4 to 6 to 8 to 10 size of list is 10 10 divided by 2 5 five. 5 five is the middle if 5 is the middle starting from 0 you have to go till 0 1 2 3 4 you have to go up till 4 okay and uh, you have to add up the result of this expression with s variable Yes, please check it out. Hurry up, hurry up, finish it fast. And 
I'm giving you complete time. Use your brain and solve this question. Japan Jot has solved. Yes, Japan Jot, explain the logic. Sir, answer is 190. Answer to 190 is okay, but I will explain the logic. How did 190 come? Sir, uh, total length is 10. So 10 divided by 2 will be 5. Okay. So, so I will loop 0, 1, 2, 3, and 4. Tak. Okay. So, sir, uske baad S, uh, S ki value hum rakhenge, uh, pehle initial value S ki 0 hogi. So, <coughs> okay. L of I that is uh, 0. L of 0 per 10 hai, to 10 into 2, 20. 20 plus 0 hogi 20. Okay. So, S ki value update hogi hogi, 20 hogi. Okay. So, uske baad, uh, next S ki value hogi 20 plus L of uh, uh, 1 that is 11 into 2. 22 plus 20 hogi 42. Okay, okay, so, sir, got, it, got, it, got it, got it, good. What you are to do is for the first five values, you multiply each value first by two and then add up the value with the S. Okay, means 20, 22, 24. 60 and 64 in values ko add up karna and you will get the result as 190 okay check it out is it clear All right. Now moving further. Yeah. Check out this question. You have a list of strings. List of strings. Uh, 20, sorry, 20, 50, 30, and 40. Okay. Count is 3 and total is 0. For C in 7546, who will tell the meaning of this statement? Who will tell me the meaning of this statement? C in 7546. Yes, Jatin, unmute yourself. Sir, C ki value ya to 7 ho sakti hai, 5 ya 4 ya 6. Very right, very correct. The value of C can be either 7, either 5, either 4 or 6. C in, matlab C in me se kuch hoga. Right? Text of count. Text of count ka matlab hai, text of three. Kyunki count ki value three hai. Text of three me kya pada hai? Forty. Forty ko kaha dal na hai? T me. Forty dal na hai? T me. To T kya ho gaya? Forty. T ko typecast kar do. Typecast means convert it into some other type. T ka T ki jo value hai 40. What is the type of 40 string? Convert it into float. To ye ban gaya 40.0. Sorry. 40.0. This has become to 40.0. Okay. Then add up c to it what is c 7 is my 7 add karo finally it become 47.0 
देन प्रिंट इट वो हमने प्रिंट कर दिया काउंट को डिक्रीमेंट करो काउंट हो गया टू गो अप आई इज नाउ सी इज टू इधर आओ सी इन सेवन अब सी क्या है फाइव पहले सी सेवन था अब सी फाइव है सो टेक्स्ट ऑफ टू को टी में डालो टी में अब क्या आ गया फिफ्टी सॉरी थर्टी थर्टी आ गया इसको स्ट्रिंग में कन्वर्ट करो थर्टी इसमें सी एड करो फाइव इट बिकम्स थर्टी फाइव एंडीबडी कैन टेल मी वॉट विल बी द नेक्स्ट वैल्यू टू वैल्यूज आई हैव कैलकुलेटेड यस हर्षवर्धन सर फिफ्टी फोर एंड द नेक्स्ट लास्ट वैल्यू ट्वेंटी सिक्स ट्वेंटी सिक्स वेरी राइट वेरी करेक्ट सो आई जस्ट शो द आउटपुट चेक इट आउट ऑल ऑफ यू प्लीज चेक आउट am i clear okay uh next question is okay see here check out this question this is the mix element list string and integer आपके पास स्ट्रिंग है फिर ट्वेंटी है फिर आर है फिर टेन है देन यू हैव एस एंड लेटर यू हैव थर्टी लेटर यू हैव थर्टी ओके क्लियर टू एवरी वन ऑल राइट now times is given zero alpha is empty string add ki value zero hai for c in range 162 c ki range hai 1 that will be 1 plus 2 3 3 2 5 am i clear to all how this has come any doubt in this line how these three values have come okay times first of all c1 hai sabse pehle c1 hai times equal to times plus c times ki value kya hai 0 c ki value hai 1 जीरो प्लस वन वन टाइम्स की वैल्यू जीरो है सी की वैल्यू वन है टाइम्स हो गया वन टाइम्स इज वन देन एल्फा प्लस डाटा ऑफ सी माइनस वन प्लस डॉलर एल्फा इज एम टी स्ट्रिंग प्लस data of c minus 1 1 minus 1 is 0 plus dollar empty string plus data of 0 plus dollar empty string plus data of 0 is p it is p plus dollar it becomes p dollar okay it becomes p dollar so this is the value of alpha add plus data of c add plus data of c add is 0 plus data of c is data of 1 0 plus 20 because data of 1 is 20 सो एड की वैल्यू क्या हो गई ट्वेंटी और तीनों को प्रिंट करा दो लूप के अंदर 
तो ये आंस, पहला आंसर क्या आया वन ट्वेंटी पी डॉलर ओके दिस इज द फर्स्ट आंसर क्लियर 